June 2nd, 2018. So I just want to show everyone uh, my rod holder system. So there's two ways you can mount this. There's this direction and then underneath. There's this little thing here to help it stay nice and secure. The only problem with this way is that I hit my bolt lift bumpers. So I really can't do it that way. If you're trailering your boat, you can. Uh, now these come off very easy. You just simply push this button and lift it up. It's simple as that. Or this is the other way you can mount it. And again, you just simply push that red button and pull it right out. Um, so these easily unscrew and slide very easy when you get in the location that you want it you just tighten them down i really like this style of rod holders the other style of rod holder that you can get this is from ram okay and uh, what you do here is you just uh, okay so let me explain this <clears throat> So I'm going to tighten this down and I'm going to show everybody this because it's a little confusing. So when you're in when you're in deep like that, you're not going to be able to get this in because of these things right here. Oops, you see that? So what you have to do is I have to unscrew this and if it doesn't unscrew, you just push these buttons down. But um, basically, it's hard to do this with so I'm going to unscrew the ball. Yep, and see, it's doing that to me. So I'm going to push these buttons down and, un and unscrew this ball. And, uh, okay, so i gotta, I got to set the phone down to do this. I'm sure you can see me doing this right now. So I'm pushing those buttons down, and I'm unscrewing. So I'm going to go quite a ways out. I don't want to take it all the way off. I'm going to go a little bit more. Okay. And see how it sticks out nice and far. Okay. So when you stick this in, you want to line this up so it goes in the track and twist it. Okay. And then what you do is you push it in. And you have to do this with two hands. And you simply just... By pushing it in, you simply screw the ball in. And that's how you install the RAM ball mounted one. Now, these aren't really necessary. You got this from Rapid Marine the Dealer. These aren't really necessary to buy because the actual rod holder, the actual RAM hold, rod, rod holder itself, will come um, with a ball itself. And just by simply buying one of these brackets, uh, you can screw that ball mount on to one of those. You can do it that way too, because otherwise you got an extra piece with the rod holder that you're not even using. Um, you know, it'll come with a ball and it'll come with a flat plate with four screw holes. Um, and like I said, you're just wasting your money. Um, the other thing, the other thing I should try too is see if they line up those plates to see if they line up with this. But uh, I'll try that in another video.